makes a quickie. When I make tutorials in presentations, I use a lot of screenshots. In order to screenshot something, until now I've used the snipping tool, but I'm not gonna show you that now because it is going away. So what I will show you is snip and sketch. In order to take a screenshot, you do click on new and the screen goes gray and you can take a picture and you can either save that picture or you could copy it and put it into your presentation. But let's say you want to show somebody how to do something that has a drop down window. I want to show somebody how to open up a Google drawing. Well, if I'm just doing that with snip and sketch regularly, I can't because the drop down window isn't there. So what I would do is I would click on instead of snip now, I would do snip in three seconds or I could even snip in 10 seconds if it's something that's a little bit more complicated. But I'm going to do snip in three seconds and then I go to here and I open up my drop down window and now that is frozen and I can take a snip of the drop down window. I can annotate it and I can say that you go into, you have to go into more and you go into Google drawings. I can copy it or save it and plunk it into my presentation. And that is how you use snip and sketch. And that's a wrap.